Hi students! Today our video is practicing a small difficult piece of vocabulary, which is the difference between the word late and the word later. later. Um, this was a conversation we had in my distance English class in our Zoom classroom and I wanted to bring this piece of vocabulary to my YouTube channel as well. So first, my pronunciation. Remember that T is almost always becoming that sound of D when we have a two-syllable or longer word. So in the word late, you do hear the T, but in the word later, later, you don't hear a strong t in the middle. When I pronounce the word late quickly, sometimes you don't hear that release of the T and you hear late held in. She was late yesterday. She was late yesterday. I saw him late last night. You hear that T held in. Now let's jump over to the discussion of the meaning and the difference between these two vocabulary words. So the word late is usually used as an adjective to mean not on time, to mean near the end of a period of time. And the word late as an adjective could also become later or latest when we are talking about comparative, comparing two things, or superlative, comparing three or more things. Let's look at some examples in sentences. She was late to the appointment. She was not on time. She was late. I arrived later than her. And you hear that D sound in here, in the word later. I arrived later than her. Here we are using the comparative, two people. One arrived first, the second arrived later. Will you be there late this evening? You don't hear that strong T at the end. I keep it in. It's unreleased. Will you be there late this evening? Near the end of a period of time. So sometimes this word later, later, can be the adjective form. But also later can be the adverb form to tell after. For example, he will be back later. One event will happen after he will be back. I went to the store and later I went home. First event, I went to the store. After the store, I went home. Later we can go swimming. I am talking to my daughter about <laughs> And I say, after something, something, we can go swimming. Later, we can go swimming. You see in these three sentences, always adverbs are more easily moved around in the sentence. You see this at the end. He will be back later. I could move it to the beginning and say later he will be back. Later, we can go swimming. I could move to the end and say we can go swimming later. It is possible to put this adverb tight inside of the verb and I could say we can go later swimming, but I don't like it as much. How are you feeling students about the difference between late or later as an adjective and later as an adverb. 
put any questions in the comments below the video. Practice putting these into a few different sentences. I can give you some quick feedback. As always, like the video, subscribe to the channel, share this video with your friends who are also practicing English so that we can all continue to improve together. Until next time, students. Bye.